Moving on to the Ice Pond Dam. Are you going to come? Jay, why don't you join us up here, since you're a big part of it? Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Mr. Chairman, we um, town meeting passed a, uh, an appropriation of $90,000 to be added to with $40,000 from the Conservation Commission right. for $130,000 to rebuild the Ice Pond Dam. We opened bids a little over a week ago, and the low bid was $228,287. And um, the gentleman who represented the company, who, who and he was not the gentleman who prepared the bid, his comment was, boy, that's low. Uh, the high bid was $318,080. There are only two bidders. Um, if we intend, and that's up to this board, uh, because you have to submit a warrant article if you intend to proceed, um, given the fact that uh, the high bid was 31880, uh, no one is going to bid under that if we back out for another bid. That's just crazy to think it will happen. Um, if we put in 350, which is very close to that, that's probably not going to be enough money because they may be over that. So the recommendation is to put in 400,000, which is an additional 200 and some odd thousand dollars that needs to be raised from taxes in order to do this particular job. Other than that, uh, the 90,000, uh, which is sitting there now because we could not award the bid, has no extension uh, right. item on it. So therefore, it's going to surplus on December 31st. What would the board's pleasure be? Okay, so uh, Mr. Bridal. Well, I think it was uh, the vote last year was uh, almost two to one that they wanted to see it done. Um, it is a lot of money, but I think we ought to let it go to the voters to see where it was last year, two to one. I think we ought to let the voters decide themselves, and it shouldn't be decided at this board. Mrs. Wolseley. First of all, we need to amend, uh, to address the um, the heading. It, it's, it should not read amend Ice Pond 2014 warrant article. It just be should be submitted by itself. The 2014 warrant article is dead and gone in two weeks. So I would certainly change that heading and submit that if you choose to, as a separate fresh article. Number two, if you think somebody's going to vote for 400,000 for this project. Um, you're much more optimistic than I am. I'm totally opposed to this. Uh, and I think that the town's money can be much, much better spent. I never liked the idea of doing this to begin with, and I think that ice pond dam should be left alone. Let the beavers do their work. Mr. Bean. Uh, I do not support the uh, right. warrant. Mr. Good. Wardell. I'm afraid I'm going to have to go with the, the other two. What did you say between the pen there? Oh. Well, with you too. Oh, okay, yeah. But he is afraid. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was kind of low key. Yeah. Did you want to say something? If I may, Mr. thank Diener. you. When um, the town purchased the ice pond in 2007, we had a lot of discussion about whether or not we were going to include the dam mm -hmm. in the purchase. And we went around um, with the town attorney's help and with the town manager's help uh, to ensure that we did include the dam because we wanted to have control over that dam and make sure make be able to make sure that it was maintained in good health as i think you all know um, that pond is well used um, it's used by residents in the winter for ice skating uh, for snowshoeing uh, there are people out there in the summer who are boating um, there are even people who are doing a little bit of fishing because there are a few fish in there um, and there are people who bring their kids just down to sit up on the bench in the meadow just to look at the pond and watch the turtles and, and watch the other wildlife that's, that's around the pond. So, it, so it's an important piece of town property. Uh, we are as disappointed as anybody is that the actual bids for the construction of this dam came in so much higher than what they were estimated at. But we still think we have a responsibility to the residents of this town who use this pond, who enjoy this pond, to maintain the pond. <clears throat> um, so I would be grateful if you would, as Selectman Bridal is suggesting, let the voters decide whether or not this is a worthwhile expenditure. 
because it's their pond. Mrs. A Wilson. quick follow-up. I don't want anything on this warrant or any other warrant that is not an absolute necessity. I don't want to be padded. I don't know how many warrant articles we're up to right now, but I don't want to see a warrant overflowing with articles. So you're standing on what you absolutely no Mr. Bean new is. And if can it can there be a sit, could citizens put in a petition for a warrant article for this? Oh, yeah. Anyone can. So if there is the interest, <coughs> by citizens, the money. is that much interest by citizens? I would I would recommend that the citizens put in a warrant article. So it sounds like there's uh, not enough votes to right. uh, put this forward. So thank you for coming in tonight. I heard that same thing. What? <laughs> I heard that same thing. <laughs> but I appreciate your consideration. Um, I know it's tough, and I know this is a tough year for the town fiscally. Yep. Um, and I know this is a challenging warrant article. So I appreciate that you took the time to consider it. Thank you, thank very, you very much, much for coming in tonight. Don't